I'm really excited about the team. I mean, obviously, we lost three really good seniors, but boy, we got some good players coming back. Uh, you know, five really good players coming back. That you know, you know, Nathan Booth is as good of a low post player uh, I've ever had a chance to coach. Uh, you know, I think John John Williams is taking the next step with with his overall development and maturity to the point where he, we feel he's a an all league player. Uh, Jordan Lauf and Zach Garber are, are two guys that are so selfless and they've gotten better. And then you, Stucky Mosley, you know, as a backup point guard last year behind Jewish Brown, didn't quite get the opportunities, but he did get a great learning experience going against Jewish every day. And he's really been good. He, he's different than Jewish. He's better defensively. Uh, he's a little more of a pass first point guard. You know, probably can't score like Jewish, but I'm not sure this team needs, you know, the scoring out of that, that position. We can score from other spots. And, and right now we got two freshmen in the starting lineup. You know, Nate Navigato is, is starting, and so is Jalen Sanford. So I, our freshman class really has a chance to be special. Okay, here. Uh, one thing I could say about our team this year, we uh, we're going to have a big strength in our togetherness. Uh, our coach is preaching uh, for us to be together a lot, so I think that would be a strength for us. Uh, the team goal is the same every year, make it to that tournament. And individually, just expanded every aspect of my game and worked extra hard with the coaches in the off season. I think, I think this team is going to be really good when it's all said and done. Now, having, said, you know, having six freshmen, we're going to have some growing pains early. Uh, you know, how many? I, I hope not that many, I, but I, I do think we'll have some. Uh, but I think when we start league play, this team could be, you know, uh, I think a really good team and hopefully be in the hunt when it's all said and done.